Hey guys, it's George. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a huge I saw it first autumn winter try and haul. So if you want to see what I picked up then please keep watching and if you did enjoy this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a big thumbs up. Okay, so I've actually never bought from I saw it first before. This is my first try and haul with them um, or like shopping with them. So everything will be first like first views honest review type thing so um i basically did a huge shop with them um i managed to get 60 percent off because i still have my student uni days login which is great but that does run out next year so that'll be an issue so um i think this came i think this was like 320 pounds but it came to like 160 so i love a discount code like was great so i picked up a few like awesome winter things because obviously it's like november now i thought you know we need to see some more like seasonal pieces um, so the first thing I did pick up was this little black roll neck mini dress. Um, it's like a ribbed material and I got it in a size 8. I'll just go back. Can you kind of see it a bit more? So I got it in a size 8 and it was £10. Um, all the prices are like without the discount, so like what they said they were on the website. But I thought £10 was actually quite good. I got it in a size 8 just because I feel sometimes with like knitted or like ribbed dresses, if they're in too big of a size, they don't like go in at the waist. They're kind of just like... I don't know just like hang and like go a bit baggy around the area and like yeah sometimes baggy is flattering but I think in dresses like this they're designed to be tight so I got it in a size 8 um which I think is actually quite a good fit on me like it's not see-through like you know sometimes if it's like a cheap black item like if it's stretched too much it goes see-through but this is like a really nice material um the roll neck is higher but I just rolled it down because I don't like necks that are too high because it makes me like a little bit claustrophobic um, but yeah, I really like this dress. I think it's a really nice fit. The material is good. It is a little bit short, um, but not like massively. Like it's quite short around the bum, but it's not like so short that I wouldn't go out on it, if that makes sense. Like I think with like a nice jacket, I think I'd be absolutely fine. Um, so yeah, I think first item, like a pretty good review so far. <laughs> the next thing I got is this black gingham jacket. Top. Um, so this was only £15, which I thought was super good for a jacket, and it's like a really nice material. I quite like the black and white, and I think it goes quite nicely with this like um, mini dress. Um, I think with this you could wear it so many different ways in the winter, but I think it's quite a nice like layering piece. Um, so it only comes in one size, but it is like super oversized and big, so I think that's absolutely fine. And it is quite long, like if I go back it's like about the same length as the dress. Um, so it's really long, really comfy, like the material is soft. So I'm like a big fan of this. I just think this is like a really nice piece. Um, and yeah, for £15, I mean, you can't really go wrong. They had this section, it was like autumn favourites for 15 or like autumn 15 or something. And it was like a load of things on the website, which was £15 and like autumn stuff. And I just thought that I was like so good because this is so affordable and it's such a nice little jacket and like so versatile. You can wear it in so many different like ways. So I've got a few more things from that section, so I will show you them. But I just thought we'd start with this jacket first. Just I thought it looked nice with this dress. And I just thought like a really good piece. And then the next piece I picked up is also another jacket type vibe. This one's just like a bigger check. And I had it in quite a few colours. But I went for like the blue. Um, just because I thought it was quite like a nice colour. And it's quite like neutral. Because I think if you get like a pink or a red one. Like they can be a little bit more difficult to like pair with other pieces. So I thought this was quite like a nice little jacket. Um... This was £30, so I think this might even be the most expensive thing I bought in this haul. Um, so £30, which for a jacket isn't even that bad. Um, and I got it in a medium because I wanted to make sure that it was oversized. Because I think with these jackets you don't want something that's too tight. Um, so I think a medium is a good fit. Like it's still super oversized, like looks quite nice. The inside of it is like kind of fluffy. It's like... It's not like fluffy, but you know when you get it's like fleecy. You know when you get like new trackies, like the inside of them like all fleecy and warm. Like this is what this feels like, and it's like a bit of a different material. It feels like I don't know. It feels more warm than the other one, if that makes sense. Um, I think this is more like jackety rather than like shirt jackety, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, I think this would just be like really nice dress down with like jeans and a jumper and stuff. So I just thought this was a really nice piece. Again, similar to the other one, like wear it in different ways. But yeah, I just really am liking this jacket trend at the moment. Okay, so the next thing I got, I actually can't believe was £15. Um, and it's this like formal white fitted coat. Um, and I think this is just such like a nice piece um, and can look like really expensive and like classy if dressed the right way. Um, so I got this in the medium and it was only £15. I think a medium is a good fit because it is like quite structured. So if I got a small, I think it would have been too tight on the arms. 
But I just think this is such a nice jacket and I think like as I said, really classy, you can like make it really dressy. Um, you could also wear it with like jeans and stuff. But I just thought it was such like a nice coat and for like work, when like we do go back into the office, like it'll be a nice piece to wear to work. But yeah, I just thought for £15, like you can't really go wrong and like, I love a coat, like I just love buying coats as you can tell so far in this haul. Um, so I just thought this was such like a nice a nice little coat. I just, yeah, I actually love this. I'm kind of obsessed with it. But for £15, I thought so good. And just a really nice piece. Okay, so the next thing I got is a shirt. So it's just this like beige, kind of like Burberry imitation print. Um, and this was actually £40, which I didn't realise. Um, I mean, I got like 60% off, so it was like 20 something. But full price, this is 40 which I do think is quite expensive for this shirt. Um, I got it in a medium as well and it is like super oversized so I just come back like it is really big I do kind of feel like I'm wearing like my boyfriend's shirt or something who's like a lot bigger than me do you know what I mean like I feel I feel like it's not it's not very me um, I do like how it's kind of like that Burberry print though like kind of like a dupe for a Burberry piece um, I mean it is nice but I do just think it's really big um, I mean maybe with a pair of jeans like slightly tucked in it could look quite cool but I'm just not 100% sure if I'm going to keep it, um, just I'm not sure how much use I'd get out of it, but I do think it is a really nice shirt regardless, so if you are looking for something like this, it is nice, like, the quality feels nice, it's soft, it's comfy, um, but I don't think I'd pay full price for this, just because, I don't know, I don't think I'd wear it that much, if that makes sense, um, but yeah, like, it's alright, but I'm not enough with it. <laughs> okay, so you know how I said that £30 jacket was the most expensive thing I bought, it definitely wasn't. Um, so I completely forgot I bought like a suit. Um, so if I just go back, you can see it a bit more. It's like this pink two-piece suit. Um, and also a little bodysuit underneath. So the bodysuit is like those double layer bodysuit. It's just sort of a, a kind of like cami top vi like vibe. Um, and that was only £5, I got it in a size 8. Don't really have too much to say about it. Um, it's just, it does what it says on the tin. It's not see-through though, which is good, because I'm wearing a black bra and you can't see it at all underneath. So if you are looking for like a white bodysuit that's not see-through, then this is a really good one. Like I will definitely say that. Um, and then we're gonna move on to the little two-piece set. So I got the trousers in a 10, just because I wasn't sure if they were gonna come up tight or small, because I do have this thing with trousers, like some fit me in a size 10, some fit me in a size 8, like some I can't fit in either, like it's so varied. Um, and I got these in a 10 and like there is so much room in them, um, so I definitely could have got an 8. But they were £40 and they are really long. I'm not really sure how nice this blazer is, is my thing. I think the trousers are nicer than the blazer. I think like the buttons just make it look a little bit cheap because they're like plastic, like if you can hear this. Like they're really plasticky buttons. I just don't necessarily think that they make it look that expensive. So I got this in a size eight. This was 40 pounds as well. Um, I almost think I could have got a six just because it is so boxy. I think this would look nicer, slightly more fitted than this like really loose blazer just because the trousers are quite long and loose as well. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm glad I tried it just to see what it was like. Like it's really thin as well. So it'd be good for summer and like the color's good for summer. But I just think, I'm not necessarily sure on it if that makes sense like it's all right but I don't love it um it's quite a nice color though I would say that it's like a salmony pink um yeah I mean it's all right but I wouldn't have paid 80 quid for it it was all going so well um so the next outfit is just not a vibe in the slightest so first let's talk about this jumper so I got this in a size 12 because I wanted it to be oversized and it's kind of fitting me like an 8, um, like it's very tight fitted, uh, it's not oversized in the slightest um, and it was £35 but I would say like the pattern of it is quite nice and I was thinking like if it was really oversized it would look quite cute um, but looking at it on me now, I mean it's skin tight, like this is tight on me, it's not very nice the fit yeah i just i'm really not liking this at all so the jumpers are no and then if i come back you'll see this little leather look skirt so on the model this looked super nice like a little skirt with like a little slit first of all the slit's tiny like it's literally like this big um i got it in a 10 it is so tight so short um 
it was £16, so, you know, not expensive at all, but, yeah, so short, I mean, it, this whole outfit is not doing anything for me. So, we're going to quickly move on to the last outfit before I have to wear this for much longer because I'm not feeling comfortable in it at all. I'm not trying to be dramatic, but I think this is actually the best £12 I've ever spent. Um, so, if you guys know, I basically am obsessed with fluffy clothes. Like, anything fluffy, fluffy blankets, fluffy pillows, fluffy slippers, fluffy dressing gowns. Fluffy jumpers, fluffy trousers, like anything fluffy I love. Um, so I saw this and I was like, oh, this is super cute. It's like a matching tracksuit and cropped jumper fluffy set. And it was £12. So I was like, I'm going to have to get it and try it. And I love it. Like, it's so soft, so comfy. Um, yeah, like, it's not very flattering because obviously fluffy things make you look thicker or wider or whatever you want to say. But... I'm not going to be wearing this out of the house. This is an at-home, comfy, cosy, snuggly piece I can like, put on on a Sunday evening if I'm cold and it's like winter. So yeah, absolutely obsessed with this and for £12, amazing. I did get it in a size 10 just because I think with loungewear you want them to be a little bit comfier, a little bit baggier. So, I mean, yeah, I'm obsessed with this. If I'm going to say get anything from this haul, it's this. Like, perfect for Christmas coming up when we're in lockdown at the moment. Like, it's got pockets. What more could you want, honestly? I'm actually obsessed. Really happy with this. <laughs> um, and then the last thing I got, I always seem to end my hauls with a pair of boots, so let's do it again. Um, so these were also from the £15 section, where things are £15 in the autumn bit. And they're like croc knee-high boots with a not a very high heel. So I love these. Um, I was really looking for like a nice knee high pair of boots which didn't have a really high heel because I don't like wearing shoes which are like super high because I can't walk in them like honestly they hurt my feet I can't walk in them there's just no point doing that so I saw these for £15 and on the website it looked like quite a small heel and I think they're probably about three inches um, I mean I'm not sure exactly but yeah I saw these and I tried them on and they're so comfy and I think they're just perfect for what I was looking for and also on the inside I have no idea if you can see this or not but they're like fluffy, so this bit's like lined, which I think is such a smart idea. Because like if I'm going out and wearing this with a skirt, like they will keep my legs warm because of the fluffy inside, which I think is just like such an amazing idea, if I'm honest. Um, so yeah, absolutely obsessed with these boots. Definitely going to be keeping them, keeping this. And yeah, I think we definitely ended on a good note. There was like that slight out there in the middle, which just wasn't doing anything for me. But I think everything else has actually been all right, like nothing too offensive. Um... But yeah, so that is literally the end of my haul. Um, I really liked it. I really enjoyed I saw it first. So I'm definitely going to shop there again in the future. If there are any brands that you guys want me to look at, which I haven't shopped for at before, um, please do let me know in the comments. I'll try my best to look at them and to order some stuff and then do a haul for you guys. Um, but yeah, I'm quite enjoying like trying out new places at the moment because I did miss Pap and I've done I saw it first. So I'll probably do somewhere else in the future as well. So that'd be super fun. But yeah, if there is anywhere you guys want me to try, then let me know. But thank you so much for watching this video i hope you guys did enjoy and if you did please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a big thumbs up thank you so much for watching as always and i'll see you next time